And it's stories like the Nasser case that have business leaders in Southside specifically working to get out in front of the sexual harassment issue, which has been obviously a nationwide conversation. Ted News reporter Coulter Anstead spoke to them about the importance of keeping everyone safe in the workplace. Hunter Burns and his partner, Stephen Gold, say the phones at their Danville law firm have been ringing off the hook with employers wanting to know about sexual harassment in the workplace. We have a lot of employers that are calling saying, you know, are we well prepared? Are, are we trained? Do we have what we need in place? Danville, Pennsylvania County Chamber of Commerce President Alexis Earhart says that's the reason the chamber asked the attorneys to speak at the business at breakfast event this morning. We heard it from members and having Burns schooled here who um, have worked a lot in this field, they offered to provide a program for us to help our members understand how to uh, address these challenges in the workplace. Burns says employers need to pay attention to and listen to their employees. Today's presentation educated employers about sexual harassment laws, highlighted common behavior and topics of discussion in the workplace that can easily be perceived as sexual harassment, and what steps, including training, employers can take to prevent sexual harassment. Burns says that in light of the high-profile cases last year, he expects to be busy later this year with local cases. I think that a lot of the cases that will be filed as a result of people becoming more aware um, uh, we would expect that they start getting filed this year. In Danville, Coulter Anstat, 10 News, working for you.